Braden, tell us about the uh, Conor McGregor knockout punch there at the end with 18 seconds to go. Uh, obviously a tough shot, but it seemed like they gave you just a little bit of, of room and you took yeah. advantage of it there. Yeah, no, I just heard paint saying, Braden, you got to go do something. We'll make a play. Something along those lines. I don't remember exactly what. Just go make a play of some sort. So, And I just remembered um, Terrence Shannon's a great defender, so I was like, I know I can't get past him. Um, so I called Z up, and I was just looking at Terrence Shannon's eyes to see if he would look, and right as he looked, that's when I shot it. So so I don't want to... <laughs> You had a couple shots like that where you just kind of pulled up and just, this is my shot, basically. I don't think you would have done that last year, maybe you would disagree with that, but how much more confidence do you have in that shot this year than last year? Yeah, I think it was just playing a role last year. Um, I think just trying to get guys the ball you know, um, in the right spots, and I think that was just my job. That's just what I thought I had to do. Um, and this year, I mean, just work I've put in, um, the confidence the coaches and my guys have in me, um, so that obviously helps. It's easier because you're out there with four guys who all want the ball. Situations yeah. like that. Yeah, no, I was. I passed it to Mason, and I looked up. There's seven seconds left. And he threw it back to me, so I was like, "Well, I mean, I gotta go do something because he's <laughs> down there." So I gotta. I guess it's my turn. Lance did not have a great day shooting, and then hits a huge three for you. And I think that's the, the result of this team. Maybe everybody has short memories on this team. Mm -hmm. This seems like right? for sure. Yeah, no, I mean everybody's a great shooter. So we're we're all right with any shots they take. Um, we expect it to go in, and when it doesn't, it's fine. Shoot the next one. What was the impact of their crowd and their venue tonight? Yeah, no, it was unbelievable. Um, uh, the arena was awesome. The crowd was awesome. I've never played here before, so being able to be a part of that and see that was really cool. What does it do to a team thickening its skin, hardening its resolve, whatever, to win in an environment like this? Yeah, I think it just, I mean, other than that, it just sucks. I mean, it's just unfortunate. Um, we just played hard, and I guess we just came out the way. Well, but, I mean, it's something that can help your guys' process as you get into the most important games of the season, right? Yeah, I guess so. You talked about uh, maybe after at the game at Iowa, you don't like coming out of the games. I don't feel like you've come out of the game a whole lot since then. Mm -hmm. Is that something where you talk to, to Coach Painter about, hey, I've got to be out there, or is it like, obviously you've got to rest at some point, but yeah. um, he's really trusted you to, to basically play 40 minutes every single night since. Yeah, I think Paint just knows the times where he's sleeping where I'm being lazy or I, he knows I'm tired. Um, and that's when he gets me those little breathers. But most of the time, like, he, he knows I get mad at him sometimes for taking me out and stuff. But I appreciate you, man. Thank you. Um, but I just, he, he just knows. It's just that it just comes down to that the other day. It's not often you guys have 12 turnovers on defense bed. Uh, you know, how cohesive were you guys all Yeah, no, I thought we did a great job defensively. Um, one through five, and they can all make a play. So we just tried to stay down and contain them in the man, and I thought we did a good job. Holding them to 71 points, that's, you probably have to look at that as something really, really monumental given what they've been doing. For sure. I mean, we knew they they can score in the 90s and the 100s, so we knew we had to kind of lock in on the defensive end. So, I mean, we got lucky and where the game played, and we were able to outscore them a little bit right there at the end. It's just kind of a matter, too, of cleaning up the offensive glass there, or the, or the defensive glass. For sure, I think, yeah, I think boxing out kind of screwed us early. Um, they got a lot of easy buckets and a lot of points off their second chance. So I think once we kind of started to box a little more, grab those rebounds and make it a little bit tougher, it was, uh, helped us out. Yeah, no, in transition, I just tried to run to him, just not let him leak out and just go make an athletic play like he always does. I mean, and he gets, he's going to get to the rim no matter what. I mean, whether I'm there or I'm not, he's, he's going to get there. So we just kind of hope that we can limit those.